I think I'll interrupt the ritual of death. Your Majesty, a thousand pardons for interrupting your thoughts, but I have news that simply cannot wait. The Conclave, I don't know if they've gone mad from fear or their delusions are of their own making, but they are planning a ritual sacrifice to grant their spirit of kings even greater strength. The Supreme Priestess of Crypta is already on the move towards the site where the ancient ritual is to be performed. You must stop her, sire. We must prevent the completion of this ritual at any cost. It no longer matters who bears the crown. If they manage to strengthen the spirit of kings with this ritual of death, then the mayhem shown by Barlog will seem by comparison the harmless pranks of a young troll. All right, very well. Please read me your poem. Stop, 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 stop. I must tell you, sire, that love and blood do not make the best rhyme. Just trust me on that one. And enough isn't much better. Otherwise, it's not bad, although Crave is written with an A. But once you become king again, you may make a special edict on that point. If you become king again. Now, shall we call the assembly to order? No, oh, okay, your king sucks at poetry, and he's an asshole, and he doesn't like to pay people on time, and yeah, he's pretty much a douchebag. He was a peasant, though, when you found him, but he's had many years to become douchey. So let's start this. Your Majesty, in this valley near the capital, there is an unholy temple to Crypta. And there is only one way to approach it. We can only assume her priestesses are lying in wait for you. Our Ratman scouts have also noticed traces of Beastmasters, snares and traps under every bush. Indeed, one very obvious trace is the Temple to Furvis you can see to the southeast. We can expect these servants of Chaos will be up to their old tricks, blockades and ambushes. As the Beastmasters haven't had much time to prepare, their blockades will be of a magical origin, and any magic of the priests will be dispelled if you destroy their temples. Hmm. A new building is complete. Well, all right then. I'm building two of every guild. Um, just Your because Majesty, I want the heroes. And... But this also has the benefit of letting you put the economic buildings sort of Your Majesty, a new building is complete. here and Your Majesty, Club can go a here new building is complete. and blacksmith blacksmith come on where are you at there you are let's put it here Your Majesty, a new building is complete. plus the houses can then be built in the middle here and well, the statue of the king is give ready. me that spell. Okay. Your Majesty, That's all I'm gonna do. Is okay, you got four in that one. Did I build four Your for Majesty, you? A new no, is but I will. I didn't build any liches, but I'm hoping. I'm hoping after I get these heroes, I'll be able to find some trading outposts. Uh, oh, they give you one. That's always useful. Who wants some? So let's protect it with the little bit of money we have left. And I do like these goblin buildings because oh, money, yeah, because they can be built so close together. Anyway, I'll let you know if something comes up. They start you out with one in range here, so you might as well grab it. One of my heroes died, but he was level 1, so I'll res him in just a second. Doesn't mean I have a graveyard now, though. So that's always a shame. And all these heroes, and uh, another hero died. Level 3, bummer. Alright, I'll keep you posted. This has gotten really pricey. There were a bunch of rangers around here, and they just kept killing my people over and over again. Yeah, this sucks ass. And there's look as another ranger popped out. So this is, this is costing me all the money I was going to use for upgrades. I had to slightly start over because these were just ruining my day. But let's try this again now that I have the scepter. Let's see if if doing it this way with the scepter in hand when they all bunch up 
all the uh, rangers here. Maybe I can kill them. And I won't have this problem. I want to get them as much as I can in range here. Okay, here they come. There we go. All dead. Sweet. And how many are on this flag? Ten. Let's hope we'll, we kill this thing quickly. And then move on to the next one. I gave everyone the blacksmith upgrades, at least the, the, the level two. And I upgraded the buildings twice with the abilities, level two and three. Level four, not yet. But we did get enough money for that. So now I just got some footage here. Now when they spawn new ones out of this, and they do, by the way, I need to bounty them. So when they get shot, they'll attack the rangers and just won't eat it. The mantle is actually a good idea for regen, but I just wanted to kill them all initially. That way people won't cower away, because they were cowering, and it was really hard to get in here and do anything. I should build minotaurs or liches next. I'll keep you posted. Oh yeah, it's Rowan. Hmm. It's like what the Ice Mage did that one time. Interesting. The quest is completed, sire. The High Priest of Furvis, MacKegan the Last. Just as I suspected. Hmm. He likes to give his enemies a chance to make his battles more interesting. Any other priest would surely create his blockades in front of the temple, not behind. <laughs> and indeed, had he done this, we would be delayed for quite some time. But not he. Sire, I expect there will be several more blockades behind the temple and several more ambushes. Oh look, here's a scepter if I ever saw one. Look at all these wolves. Wolf of Frevis. Alright, well. Keep you posted. Majesty, our heroes have found an ogre's cave. Its owner has asked for the protection of the great monster. It seems that the beastmasters have been hunting down the local ogres. The giant fears that he won't be able to defeat the hunters alone. Hmm. Helping the giant would be a perfect opportunity to demonstrate that our attitudes towards his kind have drastically changed since our encounter with Grendar the Ogre. We can show the ogres that at last they can be accepted as citizens of Ardania. A new quest for you, your majesty. So, protect the ogre. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's the next temple on my list then. Here's the quest he was talking about. There's this dude here walking around. He looks like a fucking willow wisp, to be honest. But I bounty him for a couple thousand. Uh, I'm losing a couple people on him. But I think I can kill him, yeah, see. He's half dead, more than half. I'm not sure how much hit points he has. 749. Um, looks like I can kill him, all right. Sire, you have freed the giant from an unhappy fate. He is so pleased that he is calling upon his brothers to help the great monster. It is such an amusing title, sire. Perhaps we can make use of it. For example, you might organize an order of the great monster for all your best monsters. <laughs> oh, the play on words. Yes, if you guys hold up long enough, I'll be able to use the scepter to help you out. And I'm hoping we'll kill more wolves here and, and kill this thing. Which is part of the quest. 110 days is all you have on this mission. So, I'm kind of worried. Yeah, yep, I figured he would die. I don't have that many people here. Come on, Ogre, help me out. Scepter time! Right? Scepter time? Yeah, there you go. Alright, good thing it didn't hit the Ogre. Eight people are on this quest, apparently, but... 
I don't see eight people. I hope the ogres don't just walk off into the sunset and fucking... They don't even have regen. All they have is immunity to special abilities and kicks. But they're not showing the way for me. They're not... It's not highlighting. Alright, well... I need to revive some people with the graveyard, obviously. So I'm gonna go over there and I'll keep you posted. What oh. wolves be got? Hmm. The bears won't finish! Hmm. There's another one where he kills a barrier. Okay. And I hate that voice. I hated it since we heard it a long time ago. Alright, well... Um... Okay, I'll keep you posted. Oh fuck, he sent bears in. That's all I didn't need. At least the ogres are attacking the chaos bears, but I'm losing fucking heroes left and right on this. Did they kill an, a bear den? Is that why that happened? And all the ogres died. How about that? And so the battle proceeds as planned. Another temple is destroyed, another blockage cleared, and another ambush triggered. The High Beastmaster doesn't seem to be in a hurry to show himself and sends his beasts instead. Hmm. The quest is completed, sire. We, this was expensive. I had like five grand that I had to waste on just resurrecting heroes. All the ogres died from all the chaos bears. I had to use a scepter. I mean, this shit sucks. And there is a trading post here I can build, though. So I'm going to bump it up here. You know, just more footage that you'd expect to happen. And apparently there's a wolf den over here. Probably can get somebody on that after they're all done destroying this up here. Well, it's day 39. Blacksmith has upgraded twice, so the 1,000... The 1,000 gear items. And I'm scouting out up here to hopefully get the next temple destroyed. Or the next whatever it's called. Gone. So that's where we stand. Hopefully everyone will upgrade at this time. I bountied a bear den here and then a bear den here before this. That to encourage people to come up here and encourage my artifacts to charge before I get to use them again. I'm not sure which one I want to use. Probably the scepter. So do this. Pump out 2,500 on that, and hopefully everyone's here. And I'm, I'm thinking a scepter will be needed. We'll weaken all these chaos bears. Oh, they weren't on camera, so they didn't get damaged. Oh, that's bullshit. Well, anyway, hopefully all of my heroes here will be enough. Got a nice collection here of heroes. I'm not satisfied with the performance of these heroes. Okay, hold on a second. I'll be right back. Okay, this took two scepters worth to kill these fucking chaos bears enough so I could come in here and kill this thing. Without me just getting creamed, just totally ass raped. Well, anyway, that's just a little update. Looks like I'm doing okay now. 15 interested, but that's not 15 here. That's like 6 here. Your Highness, our research is complete. And I got resurrect, finally. Probably won't need it. One more blockage is clear. The high priest sounded rather nervous this time. <laughs> Perhaps he had forgotten that there is no power in all Ardania that can stand in the way of the great king. Hmm, so you say. Your Highness, hmm. our research is complete. Apparently there's stuff over here you could search. I don't know if this is wise. But, let's see if you could even get over there. See if there's a trading post over there, like there's one here. See this trading post? <laughs> I hate chaos bears. Have I mentioned that Your before? <laughs> is they just totally suck. I mean, look, I've got a dude here. There, someone kick his ass. 
make me feel better about myself a as a person. You, your majesty. Oh, what is this? Your Majesty, hmm. there is an ancient crypt in these lands where the legendary undead hunter was buried. His knowledge will be very useful for us liches. Any of us can raise him from the dead. We just need to get near his crypt. Hmm. Well, it's time to build a trading post. And hopefully I have enough for a tower, which I don't at the moment. Oh. He's running away. What a pussy on wheels. Yeah, you need to die. Help me here. That's it. I'm oh, why did you die? I think the next artifact to use will be the mantle. <laughs> here. Well. I just wanted that fucking hero gone. And there's a thing here. Trading post there. Okay, where's these liches at? Um I don't see them highlighted on the map, really. So up here? Some lich well here's the mantle for you. All my money. Yeah, I'll keep you posted. Former undead hunter, big as death. Judging by his pale skin and pointy canine teeth, he died from some accident at work. Hmm. His face looks strangely familiar. Hmm. <laughs> Guess they got the voiceover this time. Well. I'm, not, I'm running out of days. I really need to buckle down and win this mission. I've got 14 more days before. It's just not going to work. These bear men kick my ass. So let's hopefully we can get up here. Your Majesty, we are grateful. We have what we wanted. If you are interested in the hunter's treasures, you may destroy the crypt and take them. But be warned. If you do it, his dead servants will rise to avenge him. The quest is completed, sire. Excellent. I see this undead hunter had a very lucrative business, which means he also had a large number of servants. Prepare to face an undead horde, sire. <laughs> I myself will be making an inventory of our findings. And a couple of them appear in many places. Use the mantle. No wonder there were so many that appeared. You know, I was wondering about that. I got the treasure basically before I killed him, so... Well, anyway. I don't think I'm going to succeed because I have 13 more days before the mission's over. Or the quest for this whole thing doesn't work anymore. Before you fail. Jesus, how come I can't say that? Before you fail. So I've got two more little crypts over there to destroy. Well, hopefully my men will see it through to the end, yes. Keep you posted. I'll probably fail, though, because of time. I do not recommend you send forward your mortal heroes. Do you see those black trees? This is death magic. Only the undead may enter that hmm. forest without fear. Do you really wish to destroy that beauty? Ah, well, there is a way. We must destroy the temple to Crypta that stands in the middle of this cursed land. A new quest for you, Your Majesty. Somebody help me. I'm not going to succeed. I got two days left. It's not going to work. But at least you got all the cutscenes up to this point, so I can start again and try and do it faster next time. It just, I just don't have the um, time. These have been really difficult, and look at this, I'm getting my ass kicked. I can't damage this temple because they keep spawning a lot. And all that money I had is, is, is just going into resurrecting all the time. And I think you have to have parties. If you don't have parties in this, you are completely screwed. 
apparently you have to kill the temple That's decrypta. I'm... Hmm. Well, I guess you'll see the failed, the fail message. That's it. And um, then I'll get to start over, and I'll go from there. I hate this mission. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. But at least you guys got to see all the cutscenes. And that's really all that's important. Huh. Maybe. Yeah. I, I feel pretty hollow inside. Yeah. I'm not too happy. So I'll just speed up time and... And... I'll lose. Day 115. We're screwed. I don't know why where the game hasn't ended yet. Um, see, look, the main quest. Stop the ritual of death in 110 days. Um, that's the main quest. Uh, it's 115 days. I don't know why I haven't failed yet. That's it. I'm anyway. Look at my main base. It's getting swamped with shit. That's it. Well, anyway, um, I've pretty much failed this mission, so I'm going to start over and go from there. I can't. I just can't penetrate this. So. Anyway, I'll see you guys when I've done everything up to here again. I had to restart but I've got a lot of teams now. Each guild basically I put in a team. So because of that I'm going to see how well they do when they can't flee. But when they work together and they always have a group like this. Well, So we'll see. We'll see how it works, how it pans out. I'll let you know. I think I'm about ready to destroy this thing. Quest is completed, sire. The temple to Krypta, the source of magic which had cursed the surrounding lands, has been raised to the ground, sire. Now all our forces may pass through the area unharmed. All that remains is to destroy the High Priestess of Krypta and break the ritual of death. To victory, your majesty, for Ardania! I'll explain why everything's different in a minute. I just wanted to give you that cutscene and onward to the last fucking temple. I'll explain later. Alright, see you in a bit. Blood for the goddess of death. Hmm. She who must not be named. They 121 out of 110. They haven't said I failed. Maybe my other thing wasn't going to fail either, but still. I mean, this mission sucks. I've been using the staff here to get rid of all these priestesses. I'm almost to the point where I can use it again. Got these lich towers built. That was hard, trust me. That was extremely difficult. Alright, let's see what I can do here. Watch this. I, well, they have to be in view, for God's sakes. Come on. Get back into view. Come on, guys. Now, now they're all in the black. Now I can't nuke them all in one fair swoop. Come on. There. There we go. <laughs> ah, here we go. Hey, hey, hey. Now they spawn more priestesses pretty quick. So that was just something fun to do. That might help. And the game is pretty laggy right now, so... If you can get this built, do so, because... This, this, it builds itself. And it's relatively cheap. And they do keep the undead under check. Uh, they do run past you a lot, but if they distract a few, you're okay. Um, 
Oh, man. Look at all this. This is where you need the scepter. Look at that bitch. Fucking... Fucking she who must not be named. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm not gonna bore you with more footage like this. <laughs> He's killing this thing. Just for shit, I put 500 on it, and I guess he likes that. Alright, I'll see you in a bit. Once the undead dry up via those towers who are stopping them, this thing dies pretty quick. So I'll make sure that they're still running. Close to ending. <laughs> More than 110 days, 125. But it was 97 or so when I killed that last item to get here, but then when she spawns all that undead, it took forever to kill. But this is the gate, the portal, but she's... I guess the mission's not over yet. Heh. Is this her? I think I got the ratio for volumes right, so now we won't be overpowered one way or another. Quest failed. Stop the ritual hole of death in 110 days. Somebody. Yeah. I, I couldn't. Mighty. It was close, but... It's not fair. I, shot him first. I wonder if you can still win the map. I don't know. The High Priestess of Crypta has finished the ritual. Eh. Let's go find a booth in the nearest tavern. You can read me your poem, I will impart a final bit of wisdom, and we can raise a toast to our beloved kingdom one last time before the world comes to an end. Mm -hmm. There is nothing else that the great king or his good advisor or even the gods can do for our day. Great, that is the failure. Let me try and get a success. You've done it, Damn it. Majesty. Yes! I am often easy with my praise, sire, I oh. admit. This is a great victory. Perfectly done, your majesty. Hurrah! And so on. But today, you have truly saved Ardania from untold horrors. If you had not made it in time. But the great king cannot be late, can he? Thank you, my king. Thank you. Okay, I don't even really know how I did that. Um... The you saw so many false starts like that one clip where I showed you. Okay, I got all all my guilds and teams, and let's see if that works. If that didn't work, um, coming through the snake, you saw the map was like a snake or like an S. Um, it was so stupid because when I got to the ogre, the very first time I got the footage for the ogre, I actually saved him and he sent three ogres up, you know, and he bashed the crap out of that uh, temple, he helped me bash it, and then all of a sudden these dire wolves come in. I'm sorry, um, uh, bears, chaos bears, and all the ogres died anyway. Every time since then, the ogre dies almost immediately when I find him. Hey, he needs your help. Oh, he's dead. Um, and in this map, this one, I didn't even get the lich mini quest, the one where you can get that stone, and you've seen the footage for me getting that, but I didn't get it this time. I built, the liches would just never go down there. Uh, but even though I did scout that whole area out, um, I did... I was building the temple. Initially, here's how I did it. Um, I built... Let's see... Um, it's probably better with visuals to show you. Uh, so, what I can probably do is... Proceed. Pick a general. I don't even really want a general. I mean, I've got two ledges. I've got some thingies. Uh, probably a priest. I have two priests alive. I'll pick a priest. I like priests. Um, okay. Well, anyway, I started at the bottom. I got the, um... I built one of every guild, uh, the four basics, no minotaurs. And then... Killed all the little spawn pits around me, and then... Killed the first temple. Saved the scepter, and used it on the wolves when they come in with the first ambush. And then I didn't do anything. I actually built a second of every temple, except liches, and then I built I built a second and a third of the spearman temple. As a matter of fact, let me load Death 88. Let's see, this is the last time I saved. I'm going to load this really quick, and I'll show you as a visual. 
I'm not going to actually play the game again, because this was just a luck shot. And it was day 113, so maybe that 115 was correct. I killed the portal at day 111, I think. And God, she has like 18 lives every time I'd kill her, all of a sudden, boop, full life. I don't understand. She had no potions. Her inventory showed no potions. So I don't really know how she kept resurrecting herself, but fortunately I killed her. I, I guess the 115, whatever I was wigging out of 115, maybe that was it. Um, but let me show you the map here. I can probably pause it or go down to like no speed. Let's see. Uh, come on, load, so I can show people exactly what I was doing. And maybe this will be the way to do it for you, I don't know. But, there's a couple of problems with this map. And, now that I'm done, I can finally, I can finally get, get some work done today. But let me see, let's see, go down to point two. Okay, let's warp down here. And I'll just show you. I built them all in a line here. For your Majesty, I do not recommend you send forward your Oh, I don't want that cutscene. Do I got that cutscene before this I even killed the temple, magic. so that's just a repeat, obviously. Um, I built the temples like this in a line: the spearmen, the archers, the ratmen, and then eventually the liches. And then I built, of course, the, the uh, marketplace here, the blacksmith. And then once I got the first temple destroyed. I built two more spearmen. Upgraded the first spearman hut only, uh, right here to full, basically, except for that last ability, which I don't even give a fuck about. Then I built. Then, as I got the money, I built two more archers. Upgraded the first archer so they could get all the abilities, and likewise with the spear with the ratmen, ratmen here, two ratmen. And then I actually upgraded to level three palace and then did this built this first temple and then got two priests and of course i had to upgrade the blacksmith at least the first level then i came over here i mean that was camping i think that was like day 40. i came over here ogre died i smacked this around the usual but when i smacked this around i actually built another temple and got two more priests smacked the top one around and i didn't manage to get a temple here i was thinking and then when i got the quest here the mini quest here I scouted down here, which was pretty easy. Built this lich thing, but the lich is never... But I saved this. I've actually saved this. But scouting this, I can never get a lich down here, so I never got the stone. Coming up here was almost impossible. Because of the trickle of undead never fucking stopped. And the bear man. The bear man den was here. But I did build an inn here. A pub right here. So... I built teams in this pub after I got upgraded, and then I came up here with the bear man, killed the bear man, came over here, and of course I'm not doing anything here, so everyone's dying. But if I was monitoring this, I actually got that level 30 beast man, the master guy that you kill, um, the one who keeps saying, "Oh, thin in the ambush," you know him. He actually, I actually killed him. See how I got the party members to hang around here was. Uh, they were up here killing the last den. There was a den here, a spawn pit for undead. And there was like two parties here. So, I built one lich tower and then instantly said guard for like 1500. And all of the party members came down around here and hovered. And I built two more. And as I was doing this, actually, Mr. Level 30 man came over here, the beast man. Then he started to walk this way and I killed him. And then I, I could inch my way over there and I killed that temple. Came down, the crypta thing was almost impossible. The crypto temple down there in, in the center, this thing right here, this was almost impossible. But I saved the scepter, used it here as they were coming down, so everyone was dead. Came down, and I just kept trying to heal. I had some liches, fortunately, to help me out here, so they didn't get affected by the lightning. Did that, it was day 101 when I killed this thing. I said, okay, I've got nine days, there's no way. So I bountied the thing up there, the uh, portal, and... The party members started to walk slowly up there, and I used the Zapier a couple more times. And I saw her, so I immediately bountied her. And it was about a day 113. I don't know. Look on the look on the victory screen. See what day it is. That's basically how I did this map. I would have liked to have shown you that victory, but I wasn't sure I was gonna win. And it took hours, a lot of time. So I really don't see. I really don't see the um, 
the, the point in recording all that footage, but I really wish I had gotten the footage um, of me killing the temple. And But see, they just kept walking very, very slowly. You can see my mouse cursor here, so I'll point on the shaded map right now. The Trickle of Undead, once you kill this temple, it actually destroys the barricades here on this island, so they start walking over the shallows finally, and they start coming slowly down here. But my heroes could meander at that inn, which is why I built that inn, or that pub, because they would they would run away in fear but go here, and then they would all bunch up here. And finally, it was like day 111, the main group finally got up there with the priestess. And I finally killed the portal first and her. It was it was a luck shot. This mission, while there's some skill, I had just a fuck ton of heroes and it was just a lot of luck, I think. So that's how I did it. I won't save because I already have the mission saved. And let's go to the campaign and continue. Good, thank God. Ritual of Death is over. The only one left to do is the Mystic Tavern, which is repulse the attack of the heroes of, of, of the Conclave. So basically repulse them and then you kill the king, probably, for crown and honor. Anyway, this has been a short expansion, but it hasn't been easy. So, thanks for watching, and tune in next time for the conclusion. Uh, well, the, the second to last, and then the conclusion. So, thanks for watching. <laughs>